Hey everybody, we're at the Comfort Station at Fort Wilderness. I figured since there was nobody in here, this would be a great opportunity to take you around and give you an updated tour of the Comfort Station. So we've done one two years ago. Not a lot's changed, but I figured let's go through it again. The Comfort Stations are heated and ac So it's been quite cold, it's been heated, so you don't have to worry about freezing when you go take a shower. Right down this way, we'll go that through there in just a second, are the showers. But over here, <laughs> there's Max. Um, you have three sinks that do have outlets, so if you needed to straighten your hair, blow, dr blow dry your hair, you have them right here. Um, a big mirror, so uh, if it is full over here, you can come and do what you need to do over here. Some hooks for if you have a robe, bags, whatever. And one, two, three, four. Three regular size stalls and one large stall. Uh, and there's a potty, yep, there is a potty over there. Down through here is a baby changing station and a long bench. This came in handy when the kids were a lot smaller. More hooks for your bags um, and robes. And here are the showers. You have one large uh, handicap accessible shower over here and two regular, three regular size showers over here. And the nice thing about these showers there is a lot of room in the showers. Here are the shower heads. They're actually like fairly new. There's a little space to put your shampoo and your soap. But when you're in the shower, not only do you have like a regular bathroom door that closes and locks, but you do have a shower curtain as well. So there's a lot of privacy. Um, and in between the shower and the outside door is a little bench so you can sit down and get changed. It's very quick, um, not much, but, but it is a really nice comfort station. I really like that there's no opened windows, so it's not very buggy. Um, a lot of campsites that we've been to, um, like usually this would be open, so it would either be really hot or really cold and lots of bugs come in, but that's not the case. Um, they do keep this very, very clean. Um, one thing to note is that they do require magic band access from hours 12 a.m. to 6 a.m. So that's just in case you're up in the middle of the night, there's a little added security, which is really good. Also on the outside in between the men's, women's, and the laundry area, which we'll go take a look at, is all the campground information that you would need. So if you have a question or um, want while we're wanting to know about the activities going on, they have that here. They update that every month, so this is the new December one. <laughs> they did it, it's December 1st, so they, they changed that. All the authorized vehicles, um, approved campfire pits, unapproved. Here, I'll show that to you just in case you were wondering what the approved campfire pits are. And then they also have all the information of the restaurants and their times. They do have a house phone here. Um, I actually did try to use it to call the front desk, which was 2727. It didn't work. So it's here for your convenience if you do need to, you know, call for emergencies, um, lost and found, pretty much the things that you would get on a regular hotel room phone. Um, but like I said, I tried calling the front desk with this because I did have a question it just kept giving me a busy signal like for two days. So hopefully maybe it's just an error on this phone, I don't know. And then over here is the laundry room. Credit or debit is accepted. And you do, wait, do we need a magic band? Yep. Yes, good. You do need a magic band at all hours. It doesn't matter what time of the day you do need a magic band. Insert your credit card. Start the machine, select the washer or dryer, so you would put all of your stuff, your get your washer or dryer set first, and then come on over here and um, use your credit card and select the washer or dryer. If you do forget your laundry soap, they have it here. I thought it was credit, debit, and cash. It's only credit or debit, so your cash is no good here. <laughs> when you get hungry, doing all your laundry, you can have a snack. <laughs> Wait a second. 
Ooh, new soap flavor. Mm -hmm. It's uh, $3 to do your wash and $3 to dry. Big folding table, another folding table, <laughs> and a sink if you just need to hand wash something to get some stains out. I hope you enjoyed this tour of the comfort stations. I hope you found it helpful. If you did, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe down below so you're part of the Neverland family every Thursday.